cool is this? This is awesome! <laughs> a chance to, to uh, send some experiments up into space. We don't get to do this any, every day. This is so cool. Uh, if it's on a scale of 1 to 10, I am definitely a 10 excited on this. This is one of the best learning experiences I've ever seen happen. I've watched these on YouTube. I've watched a lot of things. So thankful for the University of Wyoming for doing this for us. And this is going to be epic. Are you guys excited for the blue? Yes. Yeah, what do you think is going to happen? It's going to float up into space. I think it's going to go up in a black hole. I think it's going to like shoot confetti out of something. Yeah. Uh, and then it pop on the tree. It's stuck on top of the school. Yeah. I hope it's going to blow up. Hopefully it just goes up and nothing too bad happens. It's going to go up. It's going to go up. And then it's going to come down. <laughs> So what they're sending up into the atmosphere, we're going to get to 90,000 feet is our hope. So that's super high, right? Okay, so chemistry wants to see what happens to different kinds of states of matter, like liquids, solids, and different uh, mixtures of solutions. So they want to see if something happens to things on Earth as it goes up to outer space. We won't get into outer space, but we'll get as close as we can get. Um, environmental science is sending up air quality tests to see what's happening to the chemistry based off of the big fire that we have. So they have all kinds of experiments that are collecting data on air quality. And those are going to go up, and they're going to hopefully, if all works, they're going to collect data at different points or different heights so we can compare uh, the smoke levels down here, the smoke levels halfway up, and the smoke levels at the top. Okay? So that are, that's the experiments that we're sending up this year.